just a very quick video to help diagnose a fueling issue obviously you can hear the other cylinder kick in when we spray into the front cab the revs just pick up on the one cylinder when it's just sprayed into the rear cab so by spraying a bit or introducing a bit of fuel into that front cab or front cylinder it help decipher whether you've got a fueling spark or compression issue obviously we must have spark and compression because when we introduce a bit of fuel it's igniting and our front cylinder is kicking in like i said with the rear cylinder with the front cylinder with no fuel in if we just introduce some more fuel to the rear the revs just pick up but it's still running on that one cylinder when we spray into the front one that cylinder kicks in as well should be able to if you go back hear the change in tone of the exhaust with the second cylinder kicking in so you can do this with throttle bodies as well so we've had a yamaha r1 5vy that was on throttle bodies uh, we had one guy uh, turning the engine over trying to start it and myself just spraying a bit of fuel in to the back of the throttle bodies and it ran you could keep it running when you're manually introducing fuel to it as soon as you stopped it wouldn't run so again we knew we had spark we knew we had compression uh, but yeah there was something amiss there with the throttle bodies which we later found to be a wiring issue so yeah it's not just for carbs you can use this on throttle bodies as well it's just a very quick and easy way to tell whether you have uh, to tell whether you have an ignition problem fueling problem or compression problem